Good morning, everyone. Welcome to English 9 on Tuesday. Today's learning target is I can write an objective summary. And the lesson we're going to be working on is editing a subjective summary and making it an objective summary. The strategy we're going to be using is removing any words and or phrases that show bias or opinion. You're also going to remove any words or phrases that invoke or bring out strong emotional feelings. So we're going to take a look at an, a summary that I wrote of my favorite TV show. Remember, you wrote yours last week. So I'm going to show you how to, I'm going to use mine to show you how to remove those words. And I'm also going to get rid of me because I'm taking up too much screen. All right. So let me read my summary. My favorite fictional TV show is supposed to be a reality show on HGTV. Hilary Farr and David Byzantine are the stars of this competitive battle between the sexes. I think Hilary is mean, edgy, and sarcastic. She snaps at the homeowners when they tell her she can't have any more money to design their house. And she's mean to the builder and to David. In this show, homeowners decide that their house can't... I'm sorry. In this show, homeowners decide that their houses don't fit their lifestyles anymore. But whether they stay or go depends on experts, Hillary and David. Hillary is a designer who listens to the homeowners and remodels the house to make them want to stay. David is a real estate agent who finds houses the owners want to move into. Each episode is a competition to see if the owners will love the new design or list this house and buy a different one. Sometimes I think the show is fake, though, because their model house looks great on TV, but I read something that a couple from the show sued Hillary and David because the show, because the quality of the work was awful, but I still watch it. You should watch this show because it's crazy how David and Hillary yell at each other. Okay, that's my summary, and just reading it, you might have been able to pick up on some of my biases. So now I'm going to pop over to another document that I have ready for us to um, remove some of the bias and opinion and strong emotional feeling from my summary. So this is how you take an subjective opinion-based um, summary and move it to objective fact-based. So I'm going to use the summary that I just read to you, and I am going to take out my personal bias and my personal opinion for, about the show. I'm going to remove this and only leave the facts. So let's get started. Whoopsie doopsie. All right. My favorite fictional TV show is supposed to be a reality show. Well, guess what? It is a reality show. So it's not supposed to be. It is. Whoopsie. Supposed to be. It is a reality show. Okay. Forgot the period. Hillary Farr and David are the stars of this competitive battle between the sexes. Okay. My opinion is it's a battle between the sexes, but what it really is, it's, it's just a show. And I called it a battle between the sexes because that's how, that's the feeling I get from the show. But the, the point is, the fact is, it's a show. I think Hillary is mean, edgy, and sarcastic. Okay, when anything starts off with I think, you can pretty much assume that it's an opinion. I'm going to move, remove this entire sentence. Delete. She snaps at the homeowners when they tell her she can't have any more money to design their houses, and she's mean to the builder and David. Okay, that's me reading into the show. Um, I don't really like Hillary, so when she does things, it kind of bugs me. So I'm going to take this entire sentence out of here because it again it's my opinion in the show homeowners decide that their houses don't fit their lifestyles anymore but whether they stay or go well let's stop there is that a fact yes that is that that's exactly the premise of the show but whether they stay or go depends on experts hillary and david yep another fact and it's what the entire show is made up about Hillary is a designer who listens to the homeowners and remodels the house to make them want to stay. Again, that's what the show is about. That's all fact. There's no opinion. David's a real estate agent who finds houses the owners want to move into. Yep, another fact. Each episode is a competition to see if the owners will love the new design or list their house and buy a different one. Another fact. It's exactly what the, the, the TV show is about. 
Sometimes I think the show is fake, though, because the remodel house looks great on TV. But I read something that a couple from the show sued Hillary and David because the quality of the work was awful. But I still watch it. Okay. Big, like, red flashing lights are going off here. First of all, there's an I think in there. That means it is opinion because it's I think. And then when I say it, I read something that a couple, well, my gosh, that's all. That's all opinion. I don't have any facts in there. It's just me pulling information from something that I read. I, did, I can't even cite a source. I'm taking this all out of here. You should watch the show because it's crazy how David and Hillary yell at each other. Okay. Again, you're right. That is all my opinion. Um, that's not why you should watch the show. You, you know, you have to make up your own mind. And so I'm going to take this out. So now the big thing that I want you to look at is, number one, look at how much shorter this is. Number two, when you read through this, you're not going to find any strong emotional appeals. You're not going to find any bias or, own, or uh, my opinion. You're going to find only facts about the show. So that is how you take a subjective summary and you move it into objective. Um, now you get to practice on your own summary you wrote last week. Some of you may have to add a little bit more to your summaries because I kind of saw, I kind of saw your um, your summaries, and some of them are just a little short. But make sure what you're adding are the facts, only the facts, just the facts, not opinion. Have fun. Take care. Bye bye.